Hey, <clears throat> I heard that um, urine therapy is spreading like wildfire in Australia. And I couldn't remember where I heard it from, so I started researching and researching. And um, maybe I didn't have the right words. So I'm wondering if any of you have heard as something similar. I must have heard it on a clip from my friends in Australia that are working on a documentary about urine therapy. That could have been it, you know. But I'd, as I was researching, I ran across this very awesome article, and I'll link it below. Because once again, it says all kinds of the same things you've heard before, and it's put in different ways, or you'll get quotes from different people about how urine therapy does really work. Well, I was sitting here thinking, oh my gosh, that would be so awesome. I just, when I heard that, that urine therapy is spreading like wildfire through Australia. <laughs> oh my gosh, it just, it, I, it filled me with such excitement and warmth and wow, what if it happened in, in America? You know, what if it happened here? What would that be like? Because there are so many things that we don't know as a cumulative mind about, about things like nature and, and water and, and, you know, things that have been figured out by scientists. And I'm not putting any of that down, not at all. It's all pieces of the puzzle, except the puzzle is just a lot more multidimensional than we had initially been presented with, you know? And, and that's okay. We're getting used to this. We're getting used to all kinds of new things. Well, once you start drinking your urine, you will understand how it could spread like wildfire. When people realize that there's something about the magical ingredients, those things they haven't identified yet in urine, something about them makes water wetter. And you can test it in your own front yard or your own plants. Put a tablespoon of urine or a teaspoon if you want to start out small or a few drops if you want to start out real small to your water and you'll see you won't you won't have to water I would say it would cut it down where you're watering a third as much as you used to now think about that guys if urine makes water remain its uh, remain wet or remain in the dirt longer to nourish the plants and the dirt longer and we caught on to what that means if we can think of that at a deeper level and that thought spread like wildfire all the way from Australia to over here. I mean, people are getting it, you guys. They're getting it. And if they can catch it like wildfire over on us in Australia, we can get it over here. <laughs> We're a little slow, but we can get it. <clears throat> I don't mean that as any insult. You'll get it later if you just take the plunge. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to quit trying to sell you on drinking your pee. Um, <laughs> I just can't help myself. And there are some people who write to me every now and then from all over the world, you guys. And they're doing it, and they are feeling good, and they're still doing it, and they're still feeling good, and we're, 
We're getting healthier as a planet. You can see it out there. You can just see it. I'm not messing around. I'm not trying to pull your leg. It's one thing I will never do is try and bullshit you. That's what I love about YouTube. Boy, if you get some bullshit you're out there, you can do it for years. And <laughs> But somebody's going to call you on it. And you're not going to get away with it. But I'm not talking to you or that person. I'm talking to you. <laughs> uh, anyway, thanks for listening. And um, tell me what you know about urine therapy spreading like wildfire in Australia and around the world, right? Tell everybody you know it's spreading like wildfire. I love you guys.